The following is a presentation of EA Sports NHL 14 and what could happen in today's featured game of the National Hockey League. This is the National Hockey League on EA Sports NHL 14, a game between the Minnesota Wild and the Colorado Avalanche. This is a simulation of Game 7 between these first round Western Conference rivals, a series in which the home team has won every single game. I will be playing as the Colorado Avalanche tonight, as that is the team I predict to win this game and thus the series. Out in front though, Hollandville just sent the puck wide. Parise picks it up, feeds it to the point to Spurgeon. His shot deflected, they score! Minnesota, just a minute 55 into this game, has taken the early 1-0 lead. It's Michael Granlund. Mikhail Granlund with the deflection in front of the net by the Spurgeon shot. Zach Perez found him open at the point. And just like that, the Wild have the early 1-0 lead here in Game 7. Colorado looks to break out and tie the game up quickly. Trying to keep the home, home fans on their side. As they say, the first 10 minutes are the most important of any game for the road team as they try and weather the storm. Minnesota's done an excellent job of doing that as they get another quality chance there that Varamo has to be strong on. Shot in the slot, deflected off an Avalanche player, and that's trouble. An injured Avalanche headed back to the net as the Wild break in, three on three. They end up sending it deep and go for a change. Meanwhile, Colorado breaks out. It's Gabriel Landeskog moving up the left side, holds up, waits, takes a chance towards the net. He draws a penalty, and Minnesota commits the game's first infraction. Colorado will get the game's first power play. Stasny squares so the face off to the right of Harding. Loses the draw, Scandella takes and clears it down the ice. Colorado looks to break out, it's Johnson. Playing it up to Nathan McKinnon, the rookie sensation who's having a heck of a playoff run here for the Avalanche. Feeds back to Parento at the point, but it, didn't, it just slipped over his stick and back into their zone. Colorado again looks to regroup on the, pa the man advantage. They're into the zone, holds and waits. Feeds across to Parento. Parento finds an open winger. Johnson now on the point. Back to Parento. He squares. Fires! Save made by Harding. Harding saw that all the way and gets the whistle. Over a minute gone on this power play. 53 seconds to go. Face off won by the Avalanche. Johnson across his Parento again. He shoots through traffic. Blocked up high by the Wild. Koivu takes and clears. Parento will give chase. Gets after that puck first, and he takes a hit. Coyle now behind the net for the Wild, killing off time to Koivu. Koivu to the point. Shot through traffic, saved there by Varlamov. Played by the Avalanche, but Coyle is intercepting that again. His shot in front of the net, open man shot, rebound save. Minnesota with the pressure to kill that penalty off, and it pays dividends, keeping the Avs behind 1-0. O'Reilly now for the Avalanche, has the puck, played across to Parento. Parento from the boards, plays back to the point. Here's Johnson, he fires, save Harding. Parise gathers in the rebound and looks to break out for the Wild. At center now with the puck, he's in over the blue. Zach Parise tries to get around two Colorado Avalanche. Nearly did, but takes a hit. Puck loose in front, back to Parise. And a good backhand play by him is stopped by Varlamov. Minnesota on the attack. Point shot got through. Varlamov saw that and holds for the faceoff. Four twenty to go here in the opening period. Minnesota has the game's only goal. It's one to nothing. Barry right off the draw turns it over. Matt Cook off the wing. Cook with a shot saved made by Varlamov. Barry turns it right back over in the slot. Deflected shot save Varlamov. Good save there. Cook on the rebound. His shot in front is stopped by Varlamov. Simeon Varlamov is having to come up huge. Meanwhile, Gabriel Landeskog is in for the avalanche. Drops it off to Stasny. He doesn't get a shot away. Suter, McKinnon on him. Left it alone. Stasny now forced the pressure. And on it are the avalanche behind their own net. Stasny drops for McKinnon, but he wasn't there. The Minnesota Wild absorb a big hit. Puck out in front, it's Stasny. Stasny takes another hit. Drops to the point and it's off side and that'll do it for the first period. Minnesota 
gets the game's first goal on a deflection in front. They lead it one to nothing. Shots in the opening period heavily favor the Minnesota Wild, 10 to two. And that paid off for them as they got the game's first goal just a minute 55 into action. Mikhail Granlin deflected a point shot in over the pad of Simeon Varlamov. Landis Cog with a shot, the first of the period for the Avalanche. And they're already halfway to their first period total of two. Shot on net save. And Suter cleared the rebound to Pominville. So on the first shift, the Colorado Avalanche get as many shots as they did in the whole of the first period. Hayda breaks up a breaking attempt, and the Colorado Avalanche break the other way. It's Landis Cog. In front, McKinnon a chance, didn't get the shot away. Suter sends around his own net. Landis Cog off the boards. He shoots in the slot, deflected wide. Nathan McKinnon on Parise. Parise got around him and breaks the puck out himself. Sent to center to Granlin. The goal scorer for the Wild draws a penalty, but Parise picks up the loose puck. No touch up yet by the Avalanche. Parise in full possession. Zach Parise sent it up the boards. Granlin to Niederator. His shot deflected. Save made Varlama, and he holds on to it. Minnesota will get their first power play of the night. Faceoff is won to Fontaine for a shot that's stopped by Varlama. Nino Niederator. Niederator back to the point. Shot through traffic. They score! Deflected again! 2 0 Minnesota. A power play goal seven minutes into the second. And they lead it 2 0. Kyle Brodziak gets the goal. Suter's point shot was tipped. Nino Niederrader gets the secondary assist. And Minnesota on a pair of deflection goals lead it 2 0. Colorado turns the puck over as they're trying to establish something and really need to get the momentum back on their side. They've had very little to speak of so far tonight. Center ice feed didn't get to anybody and the Wild have the puck again. Koivu tries to break in but can't. Here's O'Reilly up the left side for the Avalanche. O'Reilly drops. It's McGinn through traffic. Tried to take a shot. Duchesne it did and it's stopped there by Harding. Scandella. Turn the puck over to McGinn. Drop the puck to the point. Colorado with pressure. Jan Heda through traffic. It didn't get on net. Here's Duchesne. Fed it across. It's Johnson. He waits for a lane. And a save made off the blocker of Harding. Colorado again with the puck. Fed it out in front. And it didn't get onto a stick of a forward. Still looking for a chance. Johnson through traffic. Save made there by Harding. Harding got a glove on it through the screen. Molson finally for the Wild gets it out. The best sustained pressure of the night for the Avalanche there, but it doesn't turn into a goal. Minnesota back into the zone on the offense. Shoveled a shot towards the net that's stopped by Varlamov. Kicked around and up the boards, and the Avalanche can't break it out. Pominville in front of Granlund. It's blocked off his stick. Under three to play here in the second period. Colorado in trouble. Down by two in game seven. Taranto, Pominville. Puck taken, onside. Here's Johnson. He shoots over the net. Held in. Duchesne at the point, offside. Duchesne send a puck toward the net after the face, after the whistle. That just results in some pushing and shoving. A minute five to go here in the second period. Colorado wins a draw to Barry. Barry's in over the line. Barry, he takes a shot off the blocker. Good save by Harding. Niederator. Niederator's around a one man. He's into the zone with a quick break. Looking for a centering feed. It's poked off his stick. Three seconds, two, and that'll do it for the second period. Minnesota adds another. And they lead game seven, headed to the third period, two to nothing. Colorado picked up the pace a bit in that second period. For five shots, they now have a game total of seven, but that's nearly half of what Minnesota has, 13. Colorado has won five of nine faceoffs in this hockey game, and now make that six of 10. That's 60% for you math enthusiasts out there. See, this game calling can be entertaining along with educational. Or maybe it's just educational, not so much entertaining. Colorado breaks in with a shot, and a save made is by Harding. Right wing charge for the Wild now, but they're hit, and Tangay tries to get back on him. Hayda played it across to Nathan McKinnon, who worked it cross ice to Hayda. Hayda, the center ice feed for Stasny, was intercepted by Pollenville. Pominville is into the zone. Takes a shot. That save made there by Varlamov, and the rebound was handled. 
Two on one now for the Colorado Avalanche. It's Stasny. Across. McKinnon. Save. Nathan McKinnon with a good opportunity off the wall. McKinnon again with a chance and it's blocked. Colorado with a little pushback here. Fontaine for the Wild breaks in. Fontaine in full possession. Varlamov a shot, or the save on the shot, and gets the face off. That'll be coming up to his left. 13.29 to go in the third period of game seven. Shot, good blocker save there. McGinn broke it out to center all the way down the ice. Will Colorado get the first? No. Scandella got back and touched that up for the icing. Colorado will not change, as they cannot. Face off though is one. A crossover to Matt Duchesne. Duchesne looks for help. Duchesne finds a man. O'Reilly, he couldn't get a shot away as he was hit. Crowd didn't like that, but no call. It was a clean hit on the play. A cross ice to Niederator. Niederator shoved, but not off the puck. He waits and holds. Niederator back to the point. Shot through traffic while Lamov saw it. Played it off dangerously, but gets a break. Colorado, three on two the other way. Two on two, two on three as they change. Across in the slot. Deflected over Duchesne's stick. Stoner. Stoner ahead to Matt Molson. Molson on the right wing for the Wild. Sends into the zone and absorbs a big hit. Paid the price for that. Hate it. Left side breakout feed for the Avalanche and they're away. Colorado looking for help. Back pass is Talbot. Talbot a shot is blocked. Here's Tangay in the corner. Alex Tangay. Tangay in front, still holding the puck. Fed over to Hayda. Hayda, he shoots. Saved by Harding. He got the glove on that and holds. 4.42 to go in regulation. Colorado, two, nothing down. Face off win. Johnson, a shot. Save off the blocker of Harding. Suter in the corner controls and sends across to Jason Pominville. Pominville's in over the line on side, but it's broken up on a big hit. Backhand pass to center, O'Reilly. O'Reilly waits, draws to the center. In front, his shot is blocked and it's Pominville with two minutes, a little over two minutes to go. Zach Parise, around one. Zach Parise tried to get a pass through the front of the net, could not. Shot through traffic, is stopped by Varlamov. Rebound to the boards, back in front. A point shot got through, just wide of the net. Under a minute to go here in regulation. Colorado needs two to tie. In the slot, shot! Save made there by Harding. Suter picks up the puck. He's to center. Suter backhands in. 40 seconds for Colorado. And Varlamov is out. Puck is loose in front of his net. Strange time for Wado to pull the goalie. McGinn. McGinn is in. He holds. Looks for help. Feeds cross ice. It's Parento. Parento. Across. In front of the net. It's blocked. And the Wild have possession. Fontaine. He plays it back over to Suter. Suter gains center. He's trying to send it towards the empty net, and he just backhands into the corner. Under 10 seconds, the shot, they score! Koivu salts this away. And the Minnesota Wild are gonna eliminate the Colorado Avalanche here in game seven. Nine point six to go. Minnesota leads it three nothing. Barry to cliche. His shot got into the glove of Harding. He holds and gets a face off with three point four to go. But it's all but a formality. As the Wild are gonna move on to the second round of the Stanley Cup playoffs, and the Avalanche will stay home as they are eliminated. I'm Eric Munter. Join me again for another game at another time. The proceeding has been a presentation of the National Hockey League on EA Sports NHL 14. Catch all new simulations of featured games on youtube.com forward slash Eric Munter.